Uh, so in this video, we're going to make a quiz. Technically, I've made it like literally impossible to do. So let's just click on play. Question number one: What is seventy-two minus seventy-one? Hundred forty-three. Incorrect. Zero point nine 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 nine. Not incorrect. Uh oh, we lost. All right, the answer is actually over here. Question number two: How many letters are there in the alphabet? So, 26, incorrect. Hmm. All right, let's just count. T 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11. There are 11 letters in the alphabet. Which one is 4? Wait, they're all 4. Oh, it's the last one. Because 1, 2, 3, 4. And square of minus 1, technically it's more letter i. So this one is cancelled out. Option number one. Option number two is not zero because zero squared is not negative one. And technically, it isn't an error. Line of negative one is technically i pi. So i pi divided by pi is equals to, yes, i, as in square root of minus one. Uh oh. Go to question, hmm, I think so. Go to question six. All right, technically, it's the end. This quiz was quite short. So this is the editor. So we'll have, when I receive next level, switch backdrop to question number Q and. So we have all this backdrop one, correct. Actually, all the backdrops. One, backdrop one, correct, incorrect. You lose question one, question two, blah, 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 question five. And when I receive correct, switch backdrop to correct. Wait one second, change question number by one. If not question number equals six, then broadcast next level. Because we have five levels, so five plus one is equals to six. When I receive wrong, if life equals zero, then switch back drop to lose, so or else switch back drop to incorrect. Wait one second and broadcast next level. Well, technically, you don't need this dot or. When the green flag is clicked, switch backdrop to backdrop one. And when I receive game start, switch backdrop to question one. Wait, why do we put broadcast next level over here? All right, it goes like this. Actually, next level will just put it to the level that is uh, the question number. So we just have the same question number. So it's basically restarting the level, not going to the next level. So now we have our play button. Quite simple to code when green flag is clicked show when this bright click oh i just forgot about all the variables so you need live question number and list there are quite a lot correct answers where one x where one y where two x where two y where three x where three y where four x ten where four y so all right so set question number to one and set live to three and broadcast game start before hiding now we'll do sprite one. So sprite one, when the green flag is clicked, height. When I receive wrong height, when I receive correct height, so that there won't be nuisance when it says correct wrong, or when the green flag is clicked. And when I receive next level, go to x item question number of where one x and y item question number of where one y. Switch costume to question number and show. When this right click. So if item num question number of correct answers equals one, broadcast correct, else change lines by negative one, broadcast wrong, wait until not mouse down. When I receive games that show, go to X item question number of where one X and Y item question number of where one X Y. Switch costume to question number. All right, so we've set. So anyway, so here are the variables. Correct answers are, it's one two four three one, where one x is negative two hundred negative hundred, uh, alright negative two hundred followed by four negative hundred, and where one y is hundred and thirty followed by four negative forty, where two x is negative one hundred followed by four one hundred, then where two y is all negative forty, where three x is hundred followed by four negative hundred, 
and when doing y is negative 40 followed by 4, 4 negative 140. Where 4 x is at negative 100 and uh, 4 hundreds, with, and where 4 y is just all negative 140. So you just duplicate this sprite. So sprite 1, you duplicate it to sprite 2, and sprite 2, you duplicate it to sprite 3. And just make sure to change this to where 2x, this to where 2y, this to 2, this to where 2x, and this to where 2y. Same for this, and we put where 3x, where 3y, 3, where 3x, and where 3y. And 4, where we do, where 4x, where 4y, 4, where 4x, and where 4y. So now we've got a complete quiz that we can play. And you can just lose three times in a row if you insist. Uh, the end. Thanks for watching. If you like it, please subscribe. And that's the end of this video.